these still exist. <laughs> For several days, the Rainbow family made the Green Mountain National Forest its home. Leave my eyes. The annual gathering brought 10,000 hippies to the state. It's a place for music, prayers for peace, and celebrating one another. Well, it's all the different people that come through here and hang out together. It's almost uh, for like the locals, it's almost like a summer camp. The group says it has no formal leadership and refused to apply for the required permit from the U.S. Forest Service. They created many new trails throughout the land as they set up camp. The gathering, which peaked on the 4th, left in its wake. Soil erosion, um, heavy foot traffic, uh, any damage to uh, wildlife habitat and other uh, natural resource related damages. The forest rangers will work with several agencies to assess the damage. Half a million federal dollars was allotted to pay for managing the event. While only a couple thousand still remain, a group of members will stay behind to help clean up. Respect for the earth and whatnot, but if we don't respect the earth, people aren't going to respect us, you know what I mean? In Mount Tabor, Rachel Cars, WPTZ News Channel 5.